guys, welcome back. Sims Beauty here with another video. So, I hope everybody's been having a good week. This week went past really, really fast. Taryn, stop staring at me. I'm recording. I wanted to jump on here and do a video really quickly because um, I was going to do one yesterday, but what did I do? Oh, um, Daquan had an appointment, so I was there. As y'all can see, my little bumpies are going away from the um, waxing. And now, usually at the end stage, it gets dry. So, I just have to make sure I'm moisturizing. Um, trying to wait for Terrence to get out of my space so I can finish my video. Because since he's been home, he's been taking over everything. Thinking everything is his. Everything. Anyway. So, I saw the... Um, interviewed Taraji P. Henson did yesterday, or not yesterday, I think it was like two days ago, on anxiety and depression with her, in regards to her suffering from those things. And I thought it was very um, good that she came out and said something about it, because a lot of the points she talked about in, um, in the video, I'm sorry, Pancake was acting crazy, I had to make sure you weren't going to take me. A lot of the points that she made in the video was accurate, like how in the African American community we don't talk about mental health and how we always have to put on the strong side. But it's okay not to be strong all the time, and it's okay if you have mental health issues. The most important thing about it is to get help. That's the most important thing. Terrence, stop doing that. It's rude. What? I'm recording and I'm picking that up because you're being rude. Not doing it. Twenty year olds. I'm telling you. <laughs> They think they know everything and they think they don't need you. It's not true. It's not true. It's a facade. Anyway. Um, yeah, I commend her. Excuse me. For coming out and speaking up and using herself as an example and letting people know that although I'm this celebrity, you know, I'm human as well. So I commend her for that. Um, hopefully a lot of other people will get behind her the only thing that makes me upset about it is that why is it different but um like why is it a difference between who what celebrity comes out like uh for example summer walker says she suffers for from social anxiety and nobody you know everybody seems to doubt her on that um but when taraji says she suffered from anxiety and depression it's like everybody is run into her with open arms why is that so I would like to know that it really shouldn't matter who it is it just should matter about people speaking up and bringing awareness to um, the situation so Daquan went to his appointment yesterday for his back we got to go back in six months to have a, um, another x-ray done and then I got up you okay Juan I just saw you. You okay? Can I have some tissue, please? I'm sorry. My nose is about to start running. Whatever this cold is that I have that's getting worse. I don't know. I think it's like a cold mixed with allergies. And then the kids' school. I just need like a little bit off here. Sorry, guys. That could, that's good. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, excuse me. The kids' school sent out a email saying that they have a whooping cough or a pertussis outbreak. Not outbreak, but somebody in the school has it. And they were, like, sending out the um, email saying that your kid could potentially have been exposed to it. Pancake, stop it. You better chill. Thank you. Um, so I'm hoping none of my kids have been exposed to that because, I, yeah, we don't need whooping cough in our house. Um, we are, I told you guys that we, um, are not celebrating Christmas. So we are having our, um, feast tomorrow. I'm going to make a roast beef, a turkey ham, because, you know, the majority of the house does not eat pork. I'm going to make some potato salad, some, um, greens. Some baked macaroni and cheese and probably some string beans. I was thinking about if I was making candy yams because I wanted it to do, I, I wanted it to did did. 
I wanted it to be like two meals. So say if you wanted roast beef or ham with potato salad and greens, that's one meal. Or you could have potato salad or ham or both with greens, macaroni and cheese, and candy yams um, or string beans or whatever. So, yeah, I'm going to do that and I'm probably going to get some Hawaiian rolls. And we're just going to have um, dinner tomorrow. Yeah, so that'll be interesting. Um, Naya purchased both our brothers a love gift. We're calling them love gifts. And they're going to purchase her something. I don't know if the boys are purchasing each other or anything. But I'm going to get them a love gift when I feel like the time is right. Um just a just because gift so we will call them love gifts um yeah i ordered my husband's birthday gift it did get here he tried it on if it he liked it only thing i have to do now is order his um our anniversary gift and i think i know what i'm gonna get like i'm gonna get him some satin pajamas because um It'll be our 12th year and traditional. If we go by it, well, we do go by the traditional anniversary gift thing for 12 years. It's either linen or silk. So I'm gonna give him some silk pajamas, probably two pairs. And um, that's going to be it. Other than that, I'm not doing much. I was hoping that I could go to church today, but I'm not feeling good. And I really don't want to overexert myself, especially being this though, I'm gonna be cooking. Tomorrow, I might record some of it, or I might record the whole thing. I don't know. Um, yeah. See if I could, you know, do something different on my channel. So, I just wanted to check in with you all and let you guys know what I was doing. I'm not really doing anything today. I'm going to relax. Um, and that's basically it. So... If no one told you that you're not today, you are just the way you are with no strings attached. And if no one told you that they love you today, I love you. So until next time, guys, peace, love, and blessings until the next one.